From wealth generation to winning it through an unbelievable season of Tropica Island of Treasure, we now connect with Team Anga, our winning team who are now one million rand richer. Last night's episode of Tropica Island of Treasure Seychelles saw all the teams from the competition coming together for a reunion show. This morning we have the winning team in studio, Anga Makubalo and Bong <laughs> Good morning. Welcome to the show. Thank you. I'm not used to seeing you so dressed. Okay, <laughs> we might ask to change this, but before we chat to you, let's take a moment when you guys seal the deal as the winning team on Tropica Island of Treasure. Welcome to Tropica Island of Treasure, Seychelles, the grand finale. This is it. This is the moment of truth. Go! Yes. I know that this isn't going to be easy. Left. Oh, left. I just broke her. Left. I'm down. Calm down. Yeah. The wave really knocked us. I'm still trying to recover from it. I don't know yeah. whether we're going to find this bottle know. or not. It's ah! driving us mad. Oh, Ida! Found it. We realized that Team C are already like yeah. six minutes ahead of us. Oh. Ah. Oh. Bongs inserts the last piece and, and we realize that we're done. Done! Yes! Wow! Wow! Yes! Wow! Yes! 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 Like I could feel that moment for you. You guys, what was it like being a part of this competition and winning? Congratulations Thank you. once again. Thank you again. so much. Hey. Well, it, it, look, it felt great being part of the competition as a whole. I mean, there are a couple of benefits. Um, we got to be on the island, which was uh, very nice and, and beautiful. Uh, we got to meet uh, other celebs that we weren't uh, really familiar with uh, yeah. previously, you know. So that was that was great as well. And we obviously got to take part in the challenges, which yeah. weren't the easiest. And Bongs and I weren't the strongest team. No, yeah. <laughs> you guys were, were pretty much the underdogs. Yeah. But yeah. you know, Bongs, how I know that you were really excited is you did the high-pitched girl scream. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I that's how you know someone's really excited. <laughs> I, think, I, I don't think it was even excitement at that time. I think it was just like me releasing all the stress yeah. that we've yes, been yes, under. Yes, because yes, yes, from yes, the word yes, go, we were under pressure. Yeah. From the word go, our pressing stick broke. Mm. Yeah. Uh, we got capsized by the sure. boat. We were behind. We couldn't find the bottle. So our go cart was like slow you know, and it didn't and go up the hill. <laughs> and we kept Jeez. on falling and falling. By the time when, when we actually inserted that last piece, I think that was just like me releasing yeah. all the pressure and the stress yeah. and well, it, the pitch just went <laughs> out. Oh, yeah, that was I the last thing. Listen, you mentioned it a minute ago. You said you guys were underdogs right from the yeah. beginning. Did you have a strategy to win this game or did you just kind of go with it and see what happened? Uh, we, not really. I don't we didn't. We just, we when it came to, to elimination, yeah. we just do not cross the finish line last yeah. because that means you go home. Yeah. That's... That's that's pretty much it. Yeah. We didn't have a strategy for the bounties. On the bounties one, I think we were more relaxed because we were like, ah, it's okay. Yeah. But elimination episodes, yeah. which yeah. we just like had to make sure that we don't come last. <laughs> that was a strategy, basically. We do not come last. Yeah. Even on the finale, I mean, we were, we were behind. Mm. But then Six the minutes. basic okay. thing, we, we told each other, we're not going to stop. Yeah. We're not going to quit. It doesn't matter how much gap they're going to open on us. Even if it's 20 minutes, yeah. we're just going to keep pushing. Yeah. Yeah. We need to get to that match. Yeah. Whether an hour later or something, but we're going to finish this. I love it. Let's talk about memories. What are you going to take away from this season's Tropica Island of Treasure Seychelles experience? Um, yo, the, the, the games were pretty exciting. And there was some stuff that were off, off camera as well that, that, that were nice. You know, I mean, we all had breakfast together. We had mm. dinner. We laughed. You know, we got to see a bit of the Seychelles, you know, so that's, that's, it was actually an experience more than it, it was a competition. We got to see the, the island and it was, it was great. That's, that's what I enjoyed. Yeah, thanks. Wow. Meeting people, basically. I mean, um, okay, like celebrities. Because some of them you actually see them on TV. And, and, and actually get to spend time with people like Anga. I mean, okay, for, for some of us, I mean, we know them from TV. And, 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 and I don't know, you, you tend to perceive them as a certain way. It's only when you get to spend time with a person and then you find out who they really are. Yeah. They're not really that um, 
like the facade that is on TV. They are real people. They also have emotions. They also sure. have real struggles. Yeah. Also, yeah. So it was quite interesting. It was quite interesting to actually get to to experience all of that. Well, from a regular audience member who never missed out on the show, thank you so much for a thrilling season of Tropical Island of Treasure yeah. Seychelles. Thank you for the shirtless moments they gave us life. <laughs> and thank you for that message of win or lose, you never, ever, ever give up. Give up, yeah. yeah.